Neighbors rescue a dog left for dead in a garbage can with an extension cord wrapped around his neck. It happened in Lorain County. News Channel 5's Curtis Jackson went there tonight. And Curtis, you actually talked to the owner of the dog. Yeah, Danita, he says he thought the dog was dead, but neighbors say it was very much alive, despite what they believe were efforts to kill him. But for his own determination to live, Charlie might not be here. What happened around his neck is a surprise to me. Was he strangled? Did somebody purposely do that? I don't know. Neighbors say Charlie escaped from a garbage can in front of his owner's house. This is how they found him, with an extension cord tied in a double knot around his neck. It, it was screaming for help. You know, blood was coming out of his eyes. His it, it looked like he had a bullet hole or a PB, PB gun shot in the head. Neighbors called police and showed them the extension cord, which is still stained with Charlie's blood. They expected police to take the dog away for his own protection. Instead, Charlie was returned to his owner. They told him to come get your dog and take that rope off his neck, and that was it. Charlie's owner told us his side of the story. What happened to Charlie? He thought Charlie hopped the fence and was hit and killed by a car, so he threw him away. As for the extension cord, how did he wind up in a garbage can with an extension cord around his neck? I don't know anything about the extension cord. The neighbors say it had a double knot. I don't know. I've never even seen it. Charlie's owner signed over custody to the Lorain County Animal Protective League. When they found him, Charlie still had not seen a vet. Obviously, he just left it in his house till last night when we got called to sit there and suffer. The owner told me that he could not afford to take Charlie to the vet, so he gave him away. Charlie is expected to make a full recovery and will soon be available for adoption through Friendship Animal Protective League in Illyria. As for allegations of inhumane treatment against Charlie, they're under investigation. I'm Curtis Jackson, News Channel 5.